girl series so today looks a little bit different from every other day because it is that time of the month ladies and you know every morning is different you never know if you're gonna get cramps and if you don't so this morning i decided to just do a self-care brush my teeth as usual put my me time on and just take a shower take some time to get ready for the day I've noticed that as I start to build healthy habits in my life, I need to really listen to my body because not every day looks the same. Not every day is super productive. Not every day you could take a shower in the morning. Sometimes you shower at night. Sometimes you exercise. But every day does not look the same and that's important to notice. but getting ready in the morning really makes such a difference in your day whether you're feeling down or whether you're feeling super good that day just getting ready for the day absolutely makes you have a productive day and i also want to be realistic not every day that i have cramps and that i feel bad i get ready but for the most part if i feel okay i do try to just do my hair do my eyebrows do my eyelashes get pretty for the day and of course do your skincare every day if you're able to because that's super important vaseline i 100 percent recommend for dry skin and just if you put it when you go to bed it has cleared my skin so much so I do recommend another thing I love to do when it's either that time of the month or I'm just not feeling well is just doing something that I really love at that moment so for example today I really wanted to do the gua sha and I really wanted to just take care of my skin but every other day I might just want to binge watch a show I might want to go on a walk sometimes I even want to exercise because that makes me feel good sometimes I just want to eat literally a ramen and just lay in the bed all day so it just depends but it's important to find your balance I've mentioned I am doing the Daniel fast so honestly doing breakfast takes me like 10 times longer than before but I am eating a lot healthier so I am enjoying that it just takes me forever now but honestly it feels so good to know that I'm putting actual vegetables actual good food in my body it's just a process to get used to
having some potatoes with jalapenos and some tomato and onions and oh my god they're so good I, I put garlic in it I put paprika salt and pepper and they're so delicious and if you haven't watched my last vlog I'm doing the Daniel fast so that means I can't have no meat fish dairy bread none of that's so only like veggies fruit nuts oils and stuff like that so this is really really good and then I got pomegranates the ones that are like already come done so I love pomegranates and then so I can't have my morning coffee it's that time of the month I made myself a chamomile tea that has no sugar and no caffeine it actually tastes pretty good I know it's because I haven't had like no sugar that it tastes better because usually I don't like it without honey but I know this breakfast is like hitting the spot it's actually so good like potatoes are so good I made more to leave some for Henry but I might eat them myself they're like so delicious I'm gonna do my bible study right now where I have breakfast and then I'm gonna plan my day try to move my body for 30 minutes each day so that's either stretching or going on a walk or doing an actual intense workout every day is different and i don't work out every day so i'm trying hummus the first time in my life i think unless i accidentally tried it somewhere else but with these little chips is that a lot mm, they're pretty good the chips are pretty good or the hummus you like hummus it's good about these crackers i mean for the daniel fast they're pretty good but i know we would pick them like on a normal day this is uh, what I had meal prepped last vlog with you guys. So this is what we're gonna eat right now. It's just that it's dark because we're about to start watching TV. It looks good. It's really good with lime. I also put hot sauce in it. It's hitting the spot. I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for my next vlog. Don't forget to like and subscribe because we're almost at 1,400, which is insane. But anyways, I love you guys. Have a nice day. Bye.